wondering how different would it be for small business if McCain Palin were currently in office? We asked people to give us their opinion. Let's check it out. It's sort of hard to quantify it except to say that I certainly don't believe there would be a focus, as much of a focus on healthcare reform, but there would certainly be more of a focus on small business. And I think uh, McCain in particular would have probably been more apt to let's get the economy back on track, uh, let's cut spending, let's put ourselves in a position where we're not borrowing into the future, and let's attempt to stave off what is looking like a major recession. And we're coming out of it, but I think we probably could have gotten um, past it a little sooner. I wasn't impressed with uh, either one. So I can't say that, th that they would have been beneficial. I never heard in any speeches that they talked about uh, what they would do for small businesses. I'm not sure things would be better because this downturn was coming. No one could stop it. We wouldn't have the health care issue that we have now, the big debate. I think we'd have more moderate reform. Um, I'm a conservative Christian and I'm a Republican, so I think things would be more to my liking. But I don't think anyone would have stopped what's going on now as far as the economy and things being bad. I seem to think that the way the country was left with the Bush administration, it doesn't really matter who was in there, they're going to have a tough job to hold. I really do. It's, it's tough regardless of who's in there. I'm John Rothman, KGO News Talk 810 talk show host, and uh, I've been involved in American politics and the American presidency for almost four decades. Uh, so when it comes to American politics and the presidency, you're talking to the right guy. You never know, but I can tell you one thing. The prayers for John McCain's health would have been absolutely overwhelming because the thought of President Sarah Palin would have scared the American people and the financial markets. Uh, I think McCain is a very stable man in terms of the way people perceive him. He painted himself in the early part of the 2000 to 2006 period as being very liberal. He had to swing to the right. Richard Nixon once said to me that for a Republican to win the nomination of his party, he had to run to the right, as a Democrat would have to run to the left. And once you're nominated, then you can run to the center. What John McCain did was, unfortunately, he was saddled with two big problems, George W. Bush who became a non-person during the campaign because we have never had a president's popularity sink as low, except maybe Lyndon Johnson in 1968 who was a prisoner in the White House. And the, the second aspect that I think McCain labored under was the, uh, the tremendous economic collapse. He couldn't get out from under that. The Republicans were blamed for that. So John McCain in the end was unable to emerge. Would Main Street have had more confidence in McCain than Obama. I think the confidence of mainstream America has been so shaken by what happened in the economic crisis that it will be very tough for any president to pull us uh, back from the brink. First of all, remember, McCain is a Republican, but he's a very odd Republican. At various times, he was viewed almost as more of a Democrat than a Republican. I'd remind you that John Kerry offered McCain the vice presidential nomination of the Democratic Party in 2004, and that they, they considered it, but in the end didn't do it. Uh, I think the Republican Party tends, in the view of many, to be more sympathetic to small business. I don't believe that to be true. Harry Truman once said that the uh, difference between a Democrat and a Republican was that the Republicans helped people who didn't need help, and the Democrats helped people who did need help. And I think part of the proof of the Bush years was the people who were advantaged were the people who were advantaged by that administration. Would John McCain have approached things differently? I don't think so. I think he played primarily also to that constituency which needed help. I think McCain, like Obama, would have done precisely what he needed to do to keep that from happening. Here's the rub. How would the Republican Party have reacted? The great criticism of Barack Obama for building up this massive deficit, I think you would have heard a deafening silence from the Republicans, as you did as George Bush built up a massive deficit. Why? Because people are very protective of their own political party. 
Uh, and so I, I think that uh, there would not have been a substantial difference between McCain and Obama in terms of policy. One thing I know for sure, our president has a very tough job. I'm Summer Morenz with DMB Digital TV, and I'll see you next time right here.